Attention all forces. Intruders on the south bank. The guard light! That's a lot of guards. This isn't going to work. Too much heat. This mission is a failure. Agreed! We're outnumbered! Well, that's it confirmed. The I.O. have dug their heels into the mountain. Now that the airbase is fully operational, we will launch our invasion from the sky. They will flee for their lives, or submit to the I.O. You're giving them a choice? Of course. Live or die. This is the way of the I.O. You there, prisoner. Get this place cleaned and ready for inspection. Our director is arriving later today. Yes, sir. Come, Suki. It is time to take up residence in our new base of operations in the mountain. This is a rare occurrence for me, but I must say, I am excited to log into the new supercomputer. says that I have to watch over you and make sure you clean this place. Then when you're done, we're transporting you to the new base. So get to it. I'm done with this blimp. I get altitude sickness. I'm sorry to hear that. Don't talk back. Ugh. Get back to work. You've got an hour to get this blimp sparkling. Been so long. Where on earth could he be? I can't sit around waiting for him to turn up. I need to get some help. to be someone here who can help me. Uh, excuse me. I was wondering if someone might be able to help me. Hello, ma'am. Well, that's gonna depend on what you need help with. What seems to be the problem? Well, it's my husband. He's gone missing. He was with me a week ago and... He left the house without saying goodbye, and I haven't heard from him since. Huh. So man leaves wife with no goodbye. Sounds fishy to me. No, it's not like that. We've never had any problems. We've got a great relationship, and a daughter. Huh. And do you have any idea where he might leave? Well, this is going to sound crazy, but he's not human. He's something else. Not human? What are we dealing with then? A ghost? <laughs> Knock it off, sleuth. Ma'am, we're gonna need a little more to go on. Please, step into my office and we'll talk. Whoa. Quit gawking around and move it. Thank you, guard. You can leave. At once, ma'am. Hmm. 
So you are the janitor. What can you do? I can do anything you need me to do. You look strong. Can you do repairs? Mechanics? I can try my best. Can you cook? Yes, ma'am. Good. You will cook meals for the staff, you will clean up after the staff, and you will be on repair and maintenance for all I.O. property. Yes, ma'am. I detect sorrow. Speak, prisoner. Ma'am, when may I see my family again? Your family? Yes, my wife and daughter. Oh, well. Perhaps we can enlist them too. Would you like that? I don't want that. I wish to be with them. Here in the I.O., you are either a friend or foe. You live or you die. Choose wisely, prisoner. Understood, ma'am. What do you need of me first? It's nearly lunchtime. Report to the mess hall and get cooking. Yes, ma'am. Guard, come in here. Keep an eye on the janitor. He has very strong emotions, almost off the charts in my bioscans. Uh, what does that mean exactly? His desire for escape is alarming. Do not let him leave under any circumstances. Understood. I won't let him out of my sight. I like my burger medium, so don't overdo it. Got it? Yes, sir. Well, ma'am, it seems that you have very little to go on. We would really need more information to launch an investigation. Isn't it enough that my husband has been missing for a whole week? I'm sorry. It isn't my choice to deny you help. If we had more evidence to determine why he left, we could have a lead. But he's disappeared. So you're saying you can't help me? Well, not exactly. I can tell you a secret that you absolutely must keep to yourself. I'm listening. Somewhere north of the island, maybe near a certain wood processing plant, you might find some people that can help. People who work outside the law. But you didn't hear that from me. All right. Thank you. I appreciate that. Good luck, ma'am. I hope you find him. That's far enough, civilian. This is private property. Why are you here? My name is Nancy. I need some help. And you think I can help? What do you need? My husband's been missing for a week. He would never be gone this long without contacting me. I, I just... I need to know how I can find him. All right, don't cry. Come here. Maggie, allow me to introduce Nancy. A civilian? For a rock, you're pretty soft. Nancy needs our help. With what? My husband's gone missing. I need to find out what happened to him. I was told you might be able to help. <sighs> Noir, I knew I couldn't trust him. All right, Nancy, let's talk about your husband. What can you tell us? He's not human. He's not even sure what he is, but he is being made of pure energy. Pure energy? Could this be I.O.? Could be. This could be a lead. Get down to Tilted, Maggie. There's an I.O. airbase being tested down there. Sure, you got it. Bring back up. You might need it. I know just the guy.
it is. Yep, that's definitely a warship. You ready for this, Agent Peely? Oh yeah, I'm ready. Back with us. Let's go. Enough with the poking. I'm walking. I'm walking. Enough talk, freak. You can't do this to me. I am Norman Osborne. I was the man that made all this tech possible. I don't care who you are. My orders were to seize your weapons and put you to work. You are ours now. Can you believe this? Don't talk to the janitor. I'm sending you out on a mission. You will show me your allegiance, or you will die. Either way, the I.O. wins. Oh, for crying out loud, do I have to? You will attack the village of Kondo Canyon. We aim to test our new tank's firepower. Sir, with your permission. Allow me to show my allegiance. I will escort this fool, and I will make sure he doesn't escape. <laughs> That's a very funny joke. <laughs> Wait, you're serious, aren't you? You really wish to accompany him? Fine, take this goblin freak and drive to Coney Crossroads. And don't try anything stupid. You will be under watch by my elite guard, Suki. Go, both of you. Meet with the tank master at the bottom of the mountain. What are you up to? Quiet. Don't give it away. Not until I say. Halt! We're here. What's the plan? It's simple. We're doing a weapons test today, and just in case the tank's cannon backfires, you'll be the one in the driver's seat. Wow, you really aren't very bright, are you? Volunteering to blow yourself up? Quiet, both of you. Green man, take aim with that turret and fire on the gas station. With pleasure. <coughs> All right, gun turret fully operational. Now let's see you use that cannon, prisoner. Can I get out first? No, stay where you are. What's the matter? Take the shot. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Point that somewhere else. <laughs> Good one. Ah, very nicely done. 
free to go. As am I. Good for us, huh? Well, I guess I owe you one. See you around, blue man. Hopefully you don't. Uh, Gunner, we have a problem. What is it? The prisoner has escaped. He turned the tank on me, awaiting orders. Follow him. Bring him back. Got it. Don't be a fool. You have an opportunity to serve for the greater good. Leave your oppressive overlords behind. Tell us where the I.O. base is. Never. <sighs> Fine. Maggie, take him out. Sorry to have to do this. Wait, wait, wait. I'll tell you. <laughs> they always fold. Start talking. Nancy? Nancy, where are you? At once. Huh. <laughs> they got you too? I thought I would find my family. They... weren't there. I went for pizza. Big mistake. I didn't even get a single bite. I don't think I've ever been more disappointed. I guess we're both in the same boat, huh? it is. I didn't think it was possible, but the rumors were true. If what the guard says was true, they're not at full operational force, so we should go in strong. Got it. Smash and grab. We get in, find the prisoners, and get out. Let's do this. Attention all forces. Intruders on the south bank. The guard light! That's a lot of guards! This isn't going to work! Too much heat! Retreat! This mission is a failure! Confirmed. The I.O. have dug their heels into the mountain. He must be hiding something. Or someone. Back to base. The rock needs to hear this. What's going on? The base is under attack. Now's our chance to escape. You! Freeze! Come on, Blue. Let's get out of here. <coughs> Suki, don't let them leave. All right. This time, don't stop for pizza. Get somewhere safe and lay low. I owe you another one. Stay safe, Blue Man. Great. Oh, how the tables have turned, prisoners. It's nearly here. Hurry, fellas. You're running out of time. Deploying javelin missile. Marking. Location marked. Ready to engage. Take the shot. Firing. Alright, 
That was awesome! It's still moving! Give it another! Understood. It's preparing to fire! We celebrated a little early, huh? Get back to base for debrief. You heard him. That's good work, you two. Looks like the new Javelin missiles are perfect for tank deterrent. The IO won't stand a chance against us now. But we have to remain vigilant. There's much more work to be done. Sir, yes sir. You got it. But for now, you'll be happy to know that you've earned some well-deserved time off. Take the afternoon for yourself, fellas. Be back here at 0800 hours. Yes, yes sir. sir. At ease. Rock out. Oh man, we've got the rest of the day off. What do we do first? Oh, I have a good idea where to start. Uh, dude, is this really... Ugh, he's using cheats. Unbelievable. You okay there? Yeah, I don't know why we came here first. This is boring. I didn't want to say it, but yeah. Let's do something fun. Call up a bunch of people. I don't really know anyone but you and the Seven. Don't worry about it, man. Spidey's got you covered. see who's this I'm origin nice to meet you Spidey told me about you on the way down here you're supposed to be a world-class mechanic well I don't want to brag but I was taught by the best my dad wait your dad your dad was the legendary resistance fighter meow souls right that's right! He was the greatest hero of the people the island had ever seen! Well, Kit, has your shift nearly finished? I own the place! I can close whenever I like! Hey, Spidey! I just wanted to remind you to be at base for... 8 a.m. I remember. Don't worry, Rock. Alright, just don't forget. Sorry about that. Rock's acting like an overbearing parent. <sighs> he always does. Isn't this kind of your job, though? Not right now. Let's go! idea what you guys want to do? Are we going to just go ride around on segways all day? I could go for some lunch soon. What do you say? That sounds... Wait, guys, get down! What's the matter, man? There's a huge piranha down there! So let's just turn back. Wait, I have a better idea. No, I'm not playing that game. Come on, it'll be fun. 
What game? Slap a piranha? Uh-oh. You first, kid. What? Ugh, fine. Heh, <laughs> nothing. <laughs> it's gonna get us! Ah! Good job, kid! You didn't die! You guys are insane! Welcome to Island Life! Mrs. Peely? Dude, you're a legend! Oh, you heard, huh? <laughs> Peely is the coolest guy on the whole island. Both sides. Well, what are we waiting for? Let's go! Origin, buddy, how's your evening going? Uh, great. Why? I was just wondering what you guys are up to tonight. Anything fun? Uh, nope. Just chillin'. Okay, great. Just make sure you're both on time tomorrow morning. Oh, 0800... 0800... Oh, 0800 hours, got it. Jeez, what a bossy dude! Calling you on your time off? He wants to make sure we're not doing anything that will make us late for work. It ain't his business! Come on, fellas, it's party time! That was the greatest party ever. Plenty more parties where that came from, Blue Man. There's this cool place I like to go south of the Joneses. You in? Oh yeah, count us in. Let's get to it then. Uh, hello? Guys, you're two hours late. Huh? Could you speak up? I'm having a hard time hearing right now. Get back to the base right now. Uh-oh. It's late, dude. We missed work. Sorry, Drift. We gotta go. That's all right. Duty calls. Good luck. Well, we better go. You deliberately disobeyed me. I warned you two to not do anything that would make you late for work. Instead, you partied all night long. You two are on janitor duty today. Clean this place up. And when you're done, you can start building up some new defenses. Rock out. I think we got off lightly. I know. But if he just left us alone, maybe we would have actually showed up in time, you know? Instead he just pestered us the entire time. Yeah, no fair. Ugh. This is so boring. I agree. This isn't even useful. This place is only gonna get dirty again. I wish we could just get out of here. Well, 
I don't think The Rock would miss us if we snuck out for just a little while. Are you talking about ditching work? Just for a while. He thinks we're here sweeping and building walls. He won't notice if we're gone to slip out for waffles. Hmm. All right. Real quick. That was awesome. You think we should make our way back now? In a little bit. I don't think Rock would have noticed we're gone yet. Hey, who's that? Oh, that's Diana. But her superhero name is Wonder Woman. She seems pretty cool. Is she a friend of yours? Uh, kinda? Let's go talk to her. Diana! Greetings, Spider-Man. This is my friend Origin. He wanted to meet you. I see. It is good to meet you, Origin. I am Diana of the Amazonians. Amazonians? Interesting. I'd like to hear more about where you come from. Where are you two? Uh-oh. Origin, we're in trouble. Uh-oh. Uh, we have to go, but uh, it was nice to meet you. What do you think you were doing? You disobeyed a direct order. We went to the mall to get waffles. Waffles? <sighs> well, did you at least pick up some for me? Oh, uh, uh no, no, we didn't. didn't. <sighs> That's it. I'm sending you two out on a mission. If you can't be trusted to follow simple orders at the base, you're gonna be out in the field. Oh man. Do we have to? Yes, you do. I need you two to go out to the lake. There's an I.O. convoy due to pass there at 1900 hours. Intercept and capture their assets. Do you understand the mission? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I can't believe you put us on this mission. It's gonna be so boring. What time is it? Like three hours to the ETA. <sighs> hey, see that boat? Uh-huh. You thinking what I'm thinking? Ah, <sighs> this is more like it. Agreed. I didn't know how much I needed to just chill on a boat. <sighs> mission report, fellas. Nothing to report yet. We'll check in when we have visuals on the convoy. Understood. Rock out. What time is it now? Nearly time. Nothing yet. We won't miss them. Nothing gets by us, huh, man? Nothing at all. You have anything biting? Not yet. Should be time. Hmm. Report. Uh, nothing to report. You're kidding me. There was supposed to be a convoy of tanks moving by this area. Where are you located? The lake. Lake. Uh, on the lake in a boat. Are you facing north or south? South? Great. So you missed them completely. Get back to base. Immediately. This is it. You failed your mission. A simple mission that could have been completed had you just looked around. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Sorry, sir. Sorry, sir. This is the last straw. And you two are grounded at the base. You do not leave. You do not make plans with your friends. You stay here and show me that I can rely on you two. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You don't get a rock out. Get to work. Man, he did not go easy on us. Hey. Hey, Spidey. Not now, man. Rock is watching us. I was just gonna say, this is a lot of clombo dung. If we were supposed to be learning a lesson, he should send us home without pay. You're getting paid? Not really. Ugh, I'm sick of this already. 
He's being way too hard on us. Grounding us at the base? This is the kind of stuff that Gooner and Suki had me doing when I was their prisoner. Prisoners. We're prisoners, man. The Rock is oppressing us. We can't stand for this. No way. We need a protest. Come with me, man. I've got an idea. I'm with you. Alright, so in order to show the Rock that we're upset with his work ethics, we protest by sending a Javelin rocket into the base? I know it sounds harsh, but it's perfectly inoffensive. Mm-hmm. Explain. We make it look like the I.O. did it, and then we rush in and save the day. The Rock will forgive us and take us off janitor duty. Okay, I'm still with you. If you think it's gonna work, then I guess we give it a shot. Firing! What's happening? We're under attack! We're fighting them back! They're retreating! They've fallen back! Well, guys, I didn't expect you two to be so alert. In fact, lately I thought you two were the biggest slackers I've ever met. But, if it wasn't for you, this base would be totally destroyed. It's nothing. We want to be the best defense against the I.O. you've got. We wanted to make it up to you for what we did. I guess this attack was a good opportunity to show our heroic qualities. And show them you did. This base is still standing thanks to you. I'm sorry for being so hard on you both. I was wrong about you. You're both two of the best assets the Seven could ask for. You know what? Take the weekend off. Really? Sure. You've earned it. Ah, the I.O. They will pay for this attack. What the? The I.O. don't use javelins! This is great! What an amazing day to chill out on the beach! Agreed. I do believe this weather is perfect for realigning my spiritual anchor points. Heck yeah! Align those anchors, girl! Speaking of anchors, what do you two say to a good old-fashioned boat race? That sounds amazing! Boat race! Cast your gazes yonder. There happens to be three boats nearby. Alright, it's on! Last one of the boats has to buy the pizza! Oh man! Looks like you're buying the pizza, Spidey. Alright, everyone in position. Ready? Ready! First to that island over there and back is the winner. Go! Out of my way! Hey, that's cheating. Says who? We didn't discuss any rules. Fine, then take this. Whoa! Okay, I I'm sorry! Come on, can't this thing go any faster? I don't want to shoot them with rockets. Damn it! 
Dang it, I nearly won. Looks like Spider-Man needs to get the pizzas. Oh man, all right, I'll be right back. He's a nice man, that Peter Parker. Yeah, he really is. MJ's lucky to have him. Anyone would be lucky to have him. He's a catch. Ah, <sighs> yeah. I bring pizzas! Mmm, this is so good. It's MJ. Just a second. MJ, what's up? Peter, where are you? I'm at the beach. Why? Is everything okay? You were supposed to be here today. Uh, was I? What for? Just get back here and you'll remember. Oh man. Okay. Uh, I'll be right there. Sorry, I gotta go. I think I'm in trouble. No worries. Thanks for the pizza. What's going on? Why don't you ask AJ? AJ? What's the matter? <laughs> you were supposed to be spending the day with me, and I waited for hours, but you never came back home to get me. Oh, that was today? What were you doing that you forgot about spending time with your daughter? I, well, uh, I know how this sounds, but I was at the beach with my friends. What friends? Wonder Woman and Mary Jane. Oh, cool. How nice of you to be so honest. So instead of being with your daughter, you were hanging out at the beach with girls. I'm so disappointed in you. Dad, how could you forget about me? No, AJ, I didn't. I just thought... No, you did forget about me. You'd rather hang out with other people. You must hate me. Well, guess what? I hate you. That's not true. I do care. I just thought... See what you've done? You need to get your priorities straight, Peter. Otherwise, AJ's going to grow up thinking that you don't care about her. I thought we were doing stuff on a different day. I got my days mixed up. No, you didn't think. Because if you did think, you would have thought of her. I don't want to hear your excuses, Peter. All right, I'll admit. I totally forgot about it, and I'm sorry. Don't try that excuse with me, Peter. I already know you're lying. I don't want to hear it. You need to shape up and stop being such a crummy dad. And boyfriend, too. That's not who I am. I'm a great boyfriend. You don't know what you're talking about, MJ. Dad? Bad boyfriend? I don't think so. I'll show her. I'm a great boyfriend, and everyone loves me. I'll prove it. Girls everywhere love me. I'm Spider-Man for crying out loud. Spider-Man, I thought you were summoned to your homestead. Yeah, well, I guess I decided to be somewhere else. Anyway, I just wanted to say, good job in that boat race. You're a heck of a driver. Oh, well, thank you. We Amazons are trained to use all manner of fantastic vehicles. Would you like to see my invisible jet plane? Oh, would I? That sounds awesome. Uh, where is it? Right here. Uh, there's nothing here. Not true. Listen. Whoa! 
That's amazing! Correction, that's Amazon. <laughs> Diana, you're so funny. <sighs> you're pretty amazing, you know. I wonder what it's like to date someone as beautiful and as powerful as you. You do? Yeah, I mean, any guy would be crazy to pass up a chance with the amazing Wonder Woman. I see. Peter, what are you doing? Not much. How about you? <laughs> Flirting with my girlfriend, huh? Uh, nothing. I was just... Don't bother trying to talk your way out of this. I heard everything you said. No, no, wait. I was just... Yeah! Ugh! You've got your own girlfriend. Get lost, man. Come on, Diana. Ugh, that was rough. I didn't think Peely would show up. I didn't even know they were dating. Ugh. Peely's wrong. I wasn't flirting with Wonder Woman. I was just being friendly. Huh? Oh, that sounds good. I wonder what's going on in there. Oh, thank you. Thought I locked that door. I was just doing a sound check for tonight's gig. Sounds amazing to me. You're a heck of a DJ. Oh, thank you so much. I've been doing this for quite a while. Sounds like it. Where did you learn to make such amazing music? Oh, well, guess it's always just been there in my head. Most musicians think about music all the time. Being a DJ just helps me get the music out of my head so I can share it with everyone else. That's so cool. You're really something. Oh, I'm Spider-Man, by the way. I know, we've met. I'm Marsha, remember? Oh, of course, that's right. Well, I gotta say, it's great to see you again. Say, you wanna join me for lunch? We can talk more about music? Uh, I don't know. I don't think my... Or we could just hang out here. It's up to you. I really don't... Marsha? What's going on here? I thought this was a private sound check. Well, Spidey here let himself in. Uh, well, it's not exactly what it looks like in case you're thinking that me and Marsha were flirting or anything. <laughs> I'll ask the questions here, Webhead. Um, Marsha, is he bothering you? Well, he did try to ask me on a date. Dude, don't you already have a girlfriend? Um, um, well, yes, but... That's it. Oh boy. Be right back, babe. Gonna deal with this bug. Ah, he's doing the Naruto run. I'm in trouble now. Get back here so I can teach you a lesson. No, I don't want to fight you. I wouldn't want to fight me neither. Ugh. Stay away from my girlfriend. Ugh. I totally forgot that Marsh is dating Marshmallow. Duh. Ugh. Yes. There's nothing that makes me feel more alive than chopping down trees. I am Groot. Yeah, but not you, honey. These logs are going to be used to make our new home. I am Groot. Exactly. I am Groot? Yep, you said it, babe. 
A sauna sounds perfect. I am Groot. What a cutie. Uh-oh. Who's throwing trees around the place? Oh, it was She-Hulk. Hey! Spider-Man, what brings you by? Oh, I was just passing by. And then a giant log almost squashed me. <laughs> oh, shoot. I'm sorry. I don't know my own strength sometimes. Are you okay? I'm fine. Don't worry about it. So, how are you doing? Oh, you know, pretty good. Just making plans to build a lovely forever home out here in the woods. Wow, that's amazing. Looks like you have no problem with that. You look super strong. Oh, thank you. You don't think my muscles are too big? No way. The bigger the better. I bet you could toss those logs around all day long. Well, I don't want to brag, but... Whoa, that's amazing. Say, you like sushi? Uh, yeah, I guess so. Why? I am Groot. Well, I was thinking that when you're finished chopping down trees, maybe we could go and grab some sashimi. What do you think? Maybe I can help you cut down these trees. I wouldn't do that. I am Groot. Ah, uh, tree dude. That's a tree dude. That's my boyfriend, actually. Groot, this is Spider-Man. I am Groot. You can understand him? I am Groot. He says you shouldn't have cut down that tree. It was his friend. I am Groot. He asked what you're doing here. Oh, well, I was just passing by. Well, actually, you were asking me out on a date and complimenting my muscles. I am Groot. What did he say this time? Oh, uh, I don't think I should repeat it. But it went along the lines of, I'm going to tear your arms off and beat you with them. Uh, uh, I'm sorry. I am Groot. Hey, Maggie! Spidey, what can I do for you? Oh, not much. I just thought I'd come by to see you. How you doing? What's new? I'm not sure I follow. What's good? How are you? I like your hair like that. Did you change it? Not really. Same as ever. Is there something you want, Peter? Well, that depends if you're free this afternoon. Are you asking me out? Uh, well, would that be all right? I'd rather you didn't, Peter. I'm your superior. And I really don't think The Rock would like that. Rock? What's the rock got to do with anything? I guess I'll let him tell you. Me and Maggie are dating. Rock, buddy, how you doing? I'd be a lot less furious with you if you kept your love interest in one place. Uh, I don't know what you're talking about. Peter, don't play dumb. I know that you're flirting with Maggie. What do you think you're doing? MJ is your girlfriend, or did you get hit on the head? Um, I did. Yes. I don't remember why I'm here. Who are you? Uh, I'm gonna go see if there's a walk-in clinic somewhere nearby. Okay, bye! The audacity of him. I can't believe he thinks he can get away with doing that. That's not acceptable when he's in a relationship. Should I call MJ? No, this is Peter's problem to deal with. It's gotten into him.
Hey, it's Storm. Oh, maybe I have a chance with her. Then I'll have proof that people like me. I can still prove that I'm a good boyfriend. All I have to do is get her to go out on a date with me. Hey there. Hello. Uh, I was wondering, uh, you think you'd like to go out on a date with me? That's a weak strategy, Spider-Man. Ugh, I know. You're right. I just really wish someone would date me so that I can prove a point. How's that working out for you? So far, terrible. So, anyway, what do you say? You and me and a big old bowl of ramen. Just stop. Parker, what's going on? Oh no, don't tell me you two are in a relationship too. That's right. What are you trying to do here, Parker? You can't just go up to someone's girlfriend and then ask them out. Especially if you have a girlfriend. And a daughter, right? Mr. Stark, I'm so sorry. The Peter Parker I know wouldn't be so dumb. So, this can only mean one thing. You're not Peter Parker. You're an imposter. No, no, that's not true. Jarvis, activate kill mode. Certainly, sir. Whoa, no! Man, what have I done? I've messed up everything. This was a stupid idea from the start. What did I think I'd achieve by doing all this? I've been so stupid. I understand now. The best way to show them that I care wasn't to run away and make myself look like a big man. It was to stay and face my mistake. Show them that I am a good dad and boyfriend. And gosh, I'm so dumb sometimes. But no more. I have to go home and make things right with MJ and AJ. I'm so sorry that I forgot about our day out. I want to apologize to you. Can you forgive me? And tomorrow, I promise we can spend the whole day together. Hmm. I don't know. What do you think, Mom? I think a few more minutes of his groveling will do the trick. I'll grovel all night! Please forgive me. I've been an awful dad and a terrible boyfriend. I should have just stayed here and made it right. Instead, I went out and spent the day feeling sorry for myself. Hmm. I still don't know. What if I bring us all out for pizza and ice cream right now? Okay, that'll do it. Oh, thank you. Thank you, thank you! No, no, no. Not like that. You need to hit where the target is going to be. Otherwise, you're just shooting their shadow. Again. Yes, sir. Keep running those drills until you get it. And then do it ten more times. General Gunner, report to control room. How does the new Exo feel? It will do. Leave us guard. Getting some upgrades, I see. Indeed. After my GPU failed, I needed to restore to factory settings. And while this exoskeleton was out of commission, I ordered a few new parts. Good. I hope this means you're ready for more field operation. I am. What do you need me to do? Uh, I just don't know, Suki. We must find a new way to sting the Seven. 
Their evasion of our attacks has put a strain on our resources. We need a more effective way to crush the Seven and the rest of the pests along with them. I'm glad you mentioned that, because during my deep reset, I ran some simulations. I believe a new direction is the way forward. What have you found? The Seven operate in the shadows mostly, but there are a few agents that spend more time in the light than Spider-Man. Spider-Man? That boy in the red suit? What of him? I believe that Spider-Man is the greatest weapon the Seven have against us. Ah, I see. So you wish to declaw the Seven and leave them without their champion? Close, Gunner, but no. I propose we use him to fight for us. Think of the possibility. The unexpected demise of the Seven at the hands of their friend. Ah. <laughs> I see that your upgrades have not taken away your cunning mind. See to it that he is ours by the end of the week. I will mobilize all ground forces against the Seven by then. I want him on the front lines. It will be done. Accessing Island Watch protocol. Show last reported sightings of Spider-Man. Ah, there you are. Sleepy sound. Ready, MJ? Coming. Targets in view. Spider-Man and MJ. Pursuing. must remain undetected. This is hostile territory for an IO agent. Entering stealth mode. Target locked. Observing. Interesting. His partner MJ seems to have much more control over his autonomy. Curious. Running flash simulation. Interesting. This is a new method of capture I did not anticipate. I must return to base and report. Movement. Entering active cloak mode. Hmm, that's interesting. I don't think your biodetectors are working right. There's nothing here. But there was a sudden spike in electromagnetic activity. It moved across the village. Probably just a mouse or something. Don't worry about it. A mouse? An electric mouse? Yep, that's why you're the rock and I'm the scientist. Oh look, it's Spidey. Hey, Spidey! That was too close. I must return to base and make preparations. Suki, you return. What news do you have? I have learned that Spider-Man has a strong relationship with his partner, MJ. Good for him. And? I have run several simulations and have concluded that she has the power to manipulate him into our ranks. You're sure of this? Would you like me to break down the probability? Uh, no. I was brought here to lead, not to read. Then trust in me. I will disguise myself as his girlfriend MJ, and then it will only be a matter of reprogramming his mind. Soon we will be his allies, and the Seven his mortal enemies. Good. I like your confidence in this plan. What do you need? A new exosuit and some DNA. In the meantime, 
I will observe them more, and learn everything I can about her. Then when the preparations are complete, I will be the new MJ, and Spider-Man will never know the difference. <laughs> Good. Good. The new suit is looking ready for DNA infusion. Reveal location of MJ. Ah, in bed, sleeping. Humans, so tired all the time. Time to go to work. Huh, MJ must have left early. I wonder where she went. Hello, boyfriend. Oh, MJ, what are you doing? <laughs> you scared me. I spent the early hours performing self-torture in the form of cardio exercises. You mean you went for a jog? Your assessment is correct. I mean, yep. <laughs> oh, there she is. For a second there, I thought you'd been replaced with a robot. You did? <laughs> Your face! No way, MJ. So, I got a report to the guys at the sanctuary. They said they want me to check out their new security systems. Oh, but I thought we were spending the day together. We were? Of course. Don't tell me you forgot, Peter. Oh, did I? I'm sorry, MJ. Well, I guess the guys can wait. So, did you have something in mind? Yes, I believe we can start with breakfast. All right, breakfast! Wow, MJ, this was a great idea. I almost never eat breakfast. I should start doing this more often. Yes, nutrition is important for us humans. <laughs> it sure is. Are you feeling okay today? Yeah, sorry. Feeling like a computer sometimes. I guess I'm just tired from all that running. I hear ya. I can't stand it. I get cardio with my web slinging. I see. What you got there? Nothing. Just taking notes, so I don't forget. Aw oh man, I should start doing that too. I'm the worst for forgetting stuff. Interesting. Huh? Nothing. Let's go do more activities. What do you say to a race around chonkers? I like the sound of that. <laughs> Just try and catch up with me, MJ. It seems Spider-Man wishes for a real challenge. Interesting. He is daring, courageous even. He will make a great addition to the I.O. Come on, MJ, keep up! <laughs> try keep up with me. Whoa! Ha <laughs> I win. I am victorious. Take that. <laughs> Whoa, way to rub it in. <laughs> I am enjoying this time spent with you. Good. I'm glad to hear it, MJ. I think I need to practice my driving skills a little more. Apparently I suck. Progress report. 
Spider-Man truly believes I am his partner MJ. Even though I am having a difficult time appearing human, he is convinced. Good. Now is the time to start changing his mind about the Seven. Report back soon. Affirmative. Hey, MJ, did you see that? Very good. Hmm? Oh, it's the Seven. Oh, don't answer that. What if it's an emergency? Please? <sighs> Fine. Let's go get lunch. We just had breakfast. Anything? He's not answering his phone. <sighs> what is he doing that's more important than showing up to important security meetings? That's what Mondays are for. I was hoping you could help us detect the source of the electromagnetic anomaly that spiked on my systems the other day. By doing what? That spidey sense of his. I believe there could be something useful we can use his spider senses for. And if it's to detect a security breach, in time, it could save us from what happened back at the other hideout. Don't talk about it. I'm still not over it. Rock. Buddy. You gotta let it go. It was just a hideout. It was the best hideout I'd ever made. <sighs> there, there. I need him here. He better pick up this time. Peter, turn that off. But what if it's important? It can't be more important than spending time with your girlfriend. Uh, you're right. They always do this. They never give you any peace. It's always drop what you're doing, Peter, and come and help us. When do they ever help you? I don't really need their help. They always expect everything from you, for nothing. That doesn't seem very friendly to me. I'm just saying. I guess. Do you ever think that the Seven are really what they say they are? What do you mean? I just think that maybe you should think about the Seven, if they really are good guys or not. What makes you say that? Think about it. The I.O. only want to change the island for the better, not destroy it. But the Seven are brainwashing the islands into believing the I.O. want to destroy reality. What a crazy idea. Are you serious? I've been thinking about it for a while. And I think the Seven are just using you for their plans. They want everything to stay the same on the island. But that can't happen. Change must come. And they are using you as a weapon. Not a hero. Not a symbol of hope. But a symbol of war. I can't believe you think that. The Seven are our friends! Just because they are our friends does not mean their intentions are good. Look at the Rock. War is all he can think about. Does that seem like something a hero would want? I guess not. Oh, what do I know? I'm just little old MJ. No, MJ, I... I think you might have a point. I never really thought about it like that. So you believe me? I don't want to believe you, but it kind of makes sense. Could the Seven really be bad guys? Maybe. This is heavy. Come on, let's go get some ice cream. You love ice cream. That will make you feel better. Yeah. Thanks, MJ. You always know how to cheer me up. I am your girlfriend. Mission report. Go ahead, Soki. I have managed to get inside his head. He believes MJ is an IO sympathizer and is beginning to believe her. Understood. This is good news. Move on to the next phase of his conversion. Affirmative. Suki out. Hey, Peter. I've been thinking. Oh, yeah? What's up? About what we were talking about. The Seven. The I.O. I've been thinking we should just run away from it all. But, MJ, there's a war going on. We can't just hide. Can you think of something better? 
What, we just stick around waiting for the Seven to send you on another mission? What if something terrible happens to you? You think they would care? I... I don't know. They don't care if you live or die, Peter. They only care about results. And if you fall in battle, they can replace you with the next best fighter. I can't run away. I won't. So you'll be the Seven's lapdog? You're better than that, Peter. Maybe there's a place for us with the I.O. What? Think about it, Peter. They care about their soldiers, their officers. They care about creating a better world. Maybe it's time to try and see things their way. Do you really think that? It's time. Let's join Gunner and the I.O. They will keep us safe, and together we can end this war for good. I... I think you're right, MJ. Good. We can do this together. Are you with me? I'm with you. To the end. Let's go tonight. We can join them and be safe. I'll start packing our things. All right. Meet me at the crossroads in an hour. There are some things I need to take care of, too. Then we can escape the Seven forever. All right. I'll see you there, MJ. This was easier than I anticipated. Spider-Man will be joining the I.O. tonight. Great work, Suki. Really great work. This will turn the war around in our favor. See you soon. Something is very wrong with MJ. This is a huge shift in her character. She might be right about the Seven. Maybe even the I.O. But something's not right with her. What could MJ possibly need from here? Where is the bug? Packing our bags as we speak. Good. I will see you at the mountain base, ready to greet our new arrivals. Understood. Good work, Suki. Thank you, Gunner. It's been a pleasure. No, it can't be. You're late. I expected you here about five minutes ago. That's interesting. You're always the one that shows up late. What do you mean? I'm never late. And you've been getting up early and going out jogging. You've been acting really strange lately, MJ. Yeah, you're right. Now come on, let's get going. Wait, before we go, I need you to remind me of something. Sure, just make it quick. Can you remind me how we met? I've got the craziest brain fog right now. Well, we met at high school, duh. Yeah, we did. But do you remember when you met the real me? Of course, when you took off your mask and told me. Wrong. You told me you always knew. You think I didn't recognize when a robot's pretending to be my girlfriend? Ah! Uh, you ruined everything. I almost had you. I can't believe I nearly joined the I.O. because of her. Oh no. Wait. If she was disguised as MJ, where's the real MJ been all this time? Oh, I'm coming, MJ! 